So I would say that there are probably uh, three major factors for the success of the research innovation enterprise landscape in Singapore. The very first really is a strong government commitment and correspondingly the sustained and steady investment in research in innovation enterprise over the years. I think the second factor is a framework that we have put in place. We always see uh, research not just in and of itself, we see this as part of a bigger system. We see research as contributing and bringing benefits to the economy and to society. Third, I believe, is our strategy. It is a strategy that really um, embraces open innovation and open talent. We believe that it is important for us to encourage and facilitate a lot of public-private partnerships because that's the best way to close the gap between discovery and uh, impact. Of course, these three success factors did not by themselves contribute to what you see. It is also built on the fact that Singapore over the years have established and created a system that is very business friendly. It's a very competitive environment. Of course, it's also English speaking, quite unique in Asia. It is also very cosmopolitan and highly livable. I guess uh, Singapore investment in research innovation enterprise has always to ensure that we remain competitive and that relevant uh, in this part of the world. We want to bring benefits to the economy and, so and to society. Ranking is not our primary focus. We let ranking take care of itself. We do the right thing for Singapore. Uh, indeed, uh, against the backdrop of slow growth in the world, I think many of the successful economies are paying even greater uh, attention to research and innovation and how that can benefit the uh, economy. And Singapore is no uh, different. The vision really is for Singapore to be one of the most attractive places for the best talent in the world, for the most exciting innovative enterprise in the world, to use this as a location for their most exciting ideas to be ideated, to be conceptualized, to be demonstrated, to be tested and then bring benefits to Singapore and of course to the rest uh, of the world. A very important part is really to see how we can derive even more synergies in everything that we do in Singapore. At a more undergirding level, I think we want Singapore as a society, as a community to evolve, to embrace the innovative uh, mindset. One that is constantly seeking to improve ourselves, to find better ways in how we do things day to day in our business, in all our approaches, and very importantly, have this daringness and willingness to keep trying.